AutoStore Mobile eForms app. So in the mobile, uh, with the mobile app, you have the ability to enter your username and password uh, based on your Active Directory credentials, or you can also enter in a PIN number that's tied to that. So I'm going to enter in a PIN number in this case. And now I'm inside of the mobile app. So I'm going to go to my Activities button. And as you can see here, there's different types of application buttons that represent different types of activities that I can do. In this particular case, I'm going to hit the registration form because I would like to uh, complete a registration form. Could be for a patient registration form, to onboard a patient, or if at an event, just an attendee registration form. So that will be that in this case. I hit the registration form. I type in the information. I can also sign. I'm also able to browse my directory right from my mobile device tablet. So I'm going to store my documents that this form information into the registration forms folder. And I'm and I have the ability to then add a file. And a file file could be from within my directory. I can go and browse and search for a file that I'd like to associate with this uh, form. I could uh, get a picture from my album on my tablet, or I have the uh, ability to also take a picture with my camera. I'm going to do that in this case. So I'm going to take a picture, and I have the ability to retake that picture or use the photo. I'm going to say use the photo. Now that picture, as well as the index information from the registration form, um, will be submitted into a auto store workflow from the mobile app. So I'm going to hit submit. Okay. Now the indexing information, as well as the picture that was taken, will now get associated with a form template. And this form template um, already exists within the folder somewhere and the information will be overlaid on top of the appropriate fields as well as the signature and the picture of the registrant. I also have the ability to preview that completed form because it's stored in my network share right from my mobile device tablet. I'm going to go into the network share, go into my registration forms, and as you can see that form was indexed and renamed based on the information that I typed in onto the form. I also have the ability to preview the document. And as you can see here, all the information that I typed in has been indeed uh, overlaid onto the form, including the signature as well as the picture that was taken.